So today we're going to do a trick where we make electric charge jump from this sphere, uh, this spherical conductor, to this uh, conducting can over here. Normally when you make contact between two, between, uh, two objects, uh, one with charge, the charge is distributed between those objects. But we're going to make the charge jump completely from here to here. So let's figure out uh, how we're going to do this. Let's go to the notes. So the trick is the jumping charge, and the principle is that the electric charge always moves to the outside surface of a conductor. So in this case, we start with a spherical conductor, which we're going to put an electric charge on, and we're going to stick it in this pail, which is neutral, has no electric charge. So in step two, as we put this charged object inside this conducting pail, charge will be induced um, inside the conductor. So negative charges will be attracted to this positively charged sphere, and therefore that leaves positive charges on the outside of the pail. So these are these extra induced charges. Now in step three, when we make contact, between the sphere and the inside of the pail, these charges on the inside cancel out, and now we're left with charge only on the outside. So when we take our sphere out, we find that it has zero charge, and the pail now has all of the charge that the sphere used to have. So let's have a look and see if we can do this uh, in real life. So here is our pail, and um, we see this is our electrometer, which measures the charge, and uh, we'll see how that works in a moment. So first I'm going to charge up this uh, glass rod with positive charges from this, uh, this sheet of smooth leather. So this is now a positively charged rod, which we can see um, causes this uh, this can to, to move here, and in fact it looks like I have sparked it, and I need to ground it again. So we now have, uh, this can is at zero charge, this rod is at positive charge. We're going to charge up our sphere here. And we can see, in fact, over here on this other electrometer that there is charge uh, on this rod here. And when we put this inside our can, we see that um, charge is induced on the can. And now what we want to do is move the charge. So we stick it inside, and we touch the inside now. And we take it out, and we see that we are, we have now charged up our, our can here. And let's find out if we've removed the charge from our sphere. This should be zero. So I come over to my electrometer, and we see that, in fact, there is no charge left on here. So we've done our experiment, and physics uh, works once again. So I'll see you next time. Well, thanks for watching. It looks like I survived today. Um, but if you want to find out if I survive the next experiment, then um, remember to click like, click subscribe, and I'll see you next time.